Welcome to Watch Mojo UK, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 times celebs showed their true colours. Did you have dinner though with Charles Taylor? I had dinner with Nelson Mandela, thank you very much. For this list, we'll be looking at famous people who have revealed their not so pleasant side, showed that they shouldn't be messed with, or have proven that they're not what they seem. What's your favourite celeb whose image has drastically changed over the years? Don't be shy and let us know in the comments below. Number 10 Morrissey vs Oliver It's the ultimate battle of a vegan and a chef that loves his meat. Morrissey claims that he refuses to eat anything that has a mother and that vegans are superior beings, but he took things way too far with his beef, pun intended, with Jamie Oliver. Morrissey once said that he'd like for Princess Anne to gas Jamie just because he cooks with meat and that he should eat his own kids. Yep, you heard that right. And it's not just Jamie. He's also said Gordon Ramsay, who proudly stated that he's allergic to vegans, should stick his head in a microwave. A charming man, isn't he? Number 9. Naomi Campbell Gets Violent Did you know that Naomi has a different side to her? She's actually been convicted of assault not one, not two, but on four separate occasions. But there's a lot more to this supermodel. Bye. She was accused of beating her assistant on the set and reportedly grabbed her by the throat. She allegedly attacked another assistant, and a third assistant accused her of holding her hostage in a hotel. She was also arrested on a flight as she allegedly assaulted a police officer. All in all, Naomi has had more than 10 assault allegations against her since 1998. Number 8. Christian Bale Gets Heated in 2009, Christian Bale popped off on the set of Terminator Salvation and started shouting at Shane Hilbert, the film's cinematographer, who walked on set to check a light. I was looking at the light. Oh, good for you! Doing that for the second time seemed to have sent Christian into a complete meltdown, and he started throwing major F-bombs at the poor man. Stay off the f***ing set, man. He even threatened to smash the lighting equipment and quit. Bit extreme, right? Since then, he's apologized and stated that the two seem to be cool with each other. However, this was the last project the two did together, so we can definitely see why. Number 7. Lord Sugar Takes It Too Far Lord Sugar may be known as the business mogul who likes to fire his apprentices, but the truth is, there's another side to his strategic persona. In 2018, he came under fire for posting a shocking tweet. He posted the Senegal World Cup squad and claimed that he recognizes some of them from the Marbella Beach, where they were multitasking and being resourceful. After being called out on his prejudice, he said he can't see why he can't make this joke and then deleted the tweet. Later, he apologized, saying he wanted to be funny. Number 6. Katie Price and Chris Hughes Never underestimate the power of Thirsty Pricey. We all know Katie Price is the queen of oversharing, but this seemed a bit much even for her. Basically, Chris admitted that Katie sent him flirty texts while he was with Olivia Atwood, but didn't reply. Katie denied this ever happened, but Chris had the actual screenshots to back it up. And guess what? There were over 50 messages sent from Katie. The two had a back and forth on social media and haven't really seen eye to eye since. But a year after the incident, Olivia Atwood confirmed that Chris did text Katie back too. Number 5. James Corden Being Disrespectful Rewind back to 2010 to see a different James from the one we know today. The James that was still trying to make a name for himself in Hollywood and introduced an award to Patrick Stewart. Don't stand at the back of the stage with your hands in your pockets, looking around as though you wished you were anywhere but here. Oh, you couldn't be more wrong, sir. So Patrick Stewart gave him awkward advice about not looking bored when the recipients are getting their awards. However, no one expected James's snide comeback. The two had a bit of back and forth going on, and James went on to say that they can all see him dying on stage right now while Patrick kept fat shaming him. From where I was sitting, I can see your belly. And this wasn't even a skit. Number 4. Loose Women Aren't So Innocent 
What exactly is it that Colleen has done that annoys you so much? Ask Colleen. 3,000 people complained to Ofcom after the cast of Loose Women faced Kim Woodburn in a very uncomfortable to watch moment. Kim and Loose Women's Colleen had beef that went back to Celebrity Big Brother. In an attempt to reconcile, Kim went on the show, but it quickly turned out to be a four against one situation. I can tell you how vile you are from day no. one. That's you what my I should have done. You're, my You're a horrible, <laughs> self centered Linda even called Kim talentless and referred to her as a demon and a witch. It's no wonder Kim ended up walking out after being grilled about the fallout, with all four panelists being on Colleen's side. I wouldn't want to sit and talk to lion well, trash I think like that's you. Sad. Pretty sure that isn't the best way to attempt a reconciliation. Number three, Louis Walsh gets called out by a Spice Girl. Louis Walsh is known as the somewhat innocent-looking X Factor judge, but what he did to Mel B was not innocent. During a live interview in 2014, the X Factor judges sat down to talk about the show. Louis suddenly put his arm around Mel B and grabbed and tapped her butt. She instantly confronted him, but everyone, including Simon Cowell and Louis, just laughed it off, even though she was visibly uncomfortable. Later on, he released a statement saying he just grabbed her as a joke. Except no one thought it was funny, Mr. Walsh. Number two, Roxanne Pallet playing victim. This one's a doozy. The Roxanne Pallet saga, commonly referred to as Punchgate, was the only thing anyone could talk about in 2018. It was so bad, it was one of the most complained about TV moments of the decade. Roxanne accused her fellow Celebrity Big Brother housemates of being aggressively violent after he playfully touched her shoulder. Oh! Woman beater! Go on, she continuously claimed that she was assaulted and didn't like that Big Brother didn't do anything about it, aka throw Ryan out. I can't believe you're letting somebody stay that's done that. After a public outrage, she was interviewed by Emma once she came out and apologised for her uncalled behaviour. Best part? Ryan later won that season. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. Number 1. Gordon Ramsay Got Inappropriate You're probably rolling your eyes right now because, duh, it's Gordon Ramsay. But no, he wasn't yelling and swearing at the people around him. That's the Gordon we know, but the Gordon we don't know was actually being super inappropriate when he was talking to Sofia Vergara on The Tonight Show with Jay Leno back in 2010. I Anything never screamed like that in real life, you know, I was all really? acting. Uh, only yes. in the bedroom. <gasps> the clip resurfaced again in 2019 and people were shocked. Knife and fork? No. <laughs> <laughs> you don't eat pizza with a knife and a fork. You just pick it up and stick it in. Not only was he mocking her accent, he made several rude innuendos and touched her inappropriately. People claim Sophia was visibly upset. Colombia, they'll you. Teach you. That's right. That's you're not touching. <laughs> it's a total cringe fest to watch, and it's not clear whether he's apologized for his actions. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo UK and subscribe for more great content.